everyone, this is Mary Gio, my channel Chuloka. I'm using my Tarot Illuminati deck to see what messages or what story is coming through for the Capricorn people out there for the month of September 2019. Already filled up five cards. We have got the Nine of Wands as your first card. Uh, we've got the Sun. Center of the reading is the Nine of Pentacles. Two of Swords. And the last card is the Six of Swords. Okay. Behind the deck is the Alchemist in reverse. Um, off the bat, Capricorn people, I feel like you are in a situation where you feel like you're trapped in this situation, okay? And you have no idea how to get out of it. You don't, you're already in that situation where you feel like not, you pretty much, your hands are tied and you want to get out of the, out of the situation so desperately and you have no idea how to break the chains and move away. This is act, this is exactly what you want to do. Okay, move away from your past, which is a nine, a nine of wands. You don't want to look into your past. Okay, it was a shitty past. You don't want to look back, uh, look back there. Okay, you felt very much uh, restricted or you know almost like a prison kind of environment. Like you know, you couldn't do much. I feel like you were hostage in your situation. Hmm? Now you just don't want to look back and just move on. Try to escape from this um, trap. I don't know for whom this is, but you just want to get out of it. Uh, out of it, okay? And you have no idea how to get out of it because even with the ten, um, it's like the eclipse and there is a sun. Okay, you're trying to make a decision, you have no idea, you are clueless, okay, your eyes are uh, blindfolded. It's, it's like you have no idea about what direction to take to get out of the situation safely, if that makes sense. To see the sun again, to have a brighter future. Some of you people out there, I might be speaking to the girls or uh, ladies out there, uh, there is children involved. Okay, there is children involved because uh, it caught my attention here as well as in this card. Okay, there is a child involved. Um, you want to get out with the child. Okay, for the better future of your child. I'm speaking to the Capricorns, yeah? Yeah, Capricorns. And you will go to any extent. If you were in a relationship, uh, a relationship and you hate being in it okay you feel um, like a hostage in this um in this um, relationship which you're having with your other person you are desperate to get out of it in one piece okay and you will go to any extent to go out of it or else this is the person whom you're dealing with okay this is the person somebody um i would say this is uh, this is not your energy this is this is not your energy. This might be the person who was dealing with you. The way he's thinking is like uh, the magician in reverse. Okay, everything. Um, it's not the player energy. It's almost like uh, a person who can go to any extent in the most negative way to keep you um, under his or her. What's probably a his? Okay. Uh, um, it's almost like your reading is coming out as a slave okay this might not be for all of you okay uh, but it's like a hostage a slave I don't know uh, the person whom you're dealing with is a little selfish okay he will get whatever he wants he will go to any extent the way he thinks is very negative okay very manipulative uh, way of thinking and it's very difficult to escape this person. It's not, it's not easy. It's not easy to see the light of the day, okay? It's not easy to, you know, escape, okay? Escape from this person, whoever that person is. Uh, no, no. Because they are somebody who, whose brain is um, very sharp and they will do, go to any extent to uh, with the ace of wands in reverse, they will go to any extent to, um, you know, flop your plans, okay? Your plans will not succeed because they are much more smarter. 
smarter, uh, smarter in a criminal sense. Like, they think like that. I don't know for whom this is, okay? You want to, um, again, you are in a relationship, you might have a child, but you want to get out of it in one piece. You want to, you know, be single, move on with your life. Okay, you, you really want to be single again. Okay, you don't want to be under this person anymore. You, you're not, you know, you don't want to keep watching your shoulder. There is this fear kind of energy. It's like um, you were always, you know, wondering who's, uh, if he's coming or he, she is coming. Okay, most probably he. I don't know who's scared of a woman, but um, you never know. Okay, uh, always watchful. Okay, always watch what, what, what would they do next. Okay, how will they hurt you next? That kind of energy. Capricorn, what's going on? You really want to be uh, in this state by yourself. Move on from all the scrap in the, uh, in the past. You just want to leave it in the past and move on. You're still clueless how to make this happen. Okay? Oh. Or it's, um, even with the hermit and the um, alchemist, it's like even you are thinking like this person, okay? You're starting to think like this person to understand, you know, how things would have a better outcome for you. If you start thinking like this person, you will know what is his next move and you can, you know, um, dunk it, okay? You can just escape. If you think like this person, there's so much conflict which is going on. Okay, you you're tired of this conflict. Okay, there might be everyday fights. Very where the energy which which is it's a little claustrophobic. While I'm reading your card, it's a little claustro uh, claustrophobic. I'm just looking looking at the door. I want to get out of the door. If you notice a couple of times I've looked at the door, I just want to. You know, get out of the room. That is a way it is for you. So much complex. Okay? You're looking at, you know, you literally like holding the lamp to get out of this darkness which you're in, trying to make a decision how to get out of it into the sun, into, you know, the open, you know, in, to your freedom. You're looking for a way to get your freedom back. And still, uh, it's all closed. It seems the door is closed. Hmm? The door is closed. You're very much, um, you know, even there is an option, you know it is not going to work. I don't know. Yeah, exactly. You feel trapped. You feel trapped. This is a claustrophobic energy which I'm getting. Even if you, you can just move the swords, okay, it's just there and you can remove this uh, blindfold, remove your hands. But the moment you reach the door, you will find out it's locked. Or probably the next door is locked. Okay, this door might be open, but the next door is locked. How will you escape that? Okay, that kind of energy. But yet, you're trying to make it work. Okay, somehow or the other, you might have failed a couple of times. Who am I speaking to? A prisoner or something? Yeah. Um, yeah, you might have failed a couple of times. Just what I'm saying, and I then I see the cards and it makes sense. Okay, justice. You want the justice. Okay, you might have failed a couple of times, but you're still hoping. Okay, you're not losing faith. You're still trying. Okay, because there might be a child involved as well. Okay, you might uh, want some kind of a judicial help. Or you might be waiting for, uh, you know, karma to help him or something of that sort. You want some kind of a justice hmm? and walk away. You don't want to come back. This is a no U-turn card for me. With this Eight of Cups energy, it's just not walking away. It is not looking back. Just what I said with the Nine of Wands. You don't want to look back into your past. It's again in reverse. You don't want to look back into the past. It's so crappy. You don't want to even think about it. Mm -hmm. Not even let the shadows of your past affect your future with these two cards with the sun. That's why you're not looking back into the past. You don't want it to affect or you know cloud up your cloud up your future. Mm -hmm. 
none of the darkness you want to invite into your new life okay uh, it's like you don't want to wait anymore and want some kind of an options okay looking out for some kind of an options which is like you know you want to leave your past in the back whatever it was okay it, it might be a family situation uh, I, I will say it's just not you know just boyfriend girlfriend or anything you might be married you might be in an official relationship with this person and have children as well but then it has come to a full stop okay it's not it's not happening this is something about you know once upon a time it was good not anymore you're suffocating in this relationship okay it's not working anymore three of pentacles in reverse you want to get out of it you want to get out of the situation where you feel like you know you're desperate to get out of the situation I'll stop you. Ugh. It's the same thing. It's almost like however you try, it's like a dead end. Dead end. But still, your hope is this five line story. Yeah, five card story is your storyline. This is what you want. Okay? To be single. To live your life just move away from your past i'm not going to repeat the same thing again but just what i said hmm? i don't know for how many people this makes sense even if it is for one of you i've done my job let me see um it's all the same so let's see what is a sun card about if i pull for either of them it would be the same story but Let's go with the brightest card. Yes, you're waiting. Exactly. I'm not even kidding with you guys. Seven of Pentacles, you're waiting for getting away. I guess this is what you're looking out for. You're waiting to get away. You're waiting on this chance to slay away. Leave the past, uh, you know, the life. Five Pentacles. Do I have the same any, anything anymore? I would be wasting your time and my, my time as well. It's just 12 minutes and I've already finished the story. These are just clarifiers for me. I, I can just talk just looking at the cards and uh, I just do it just to you know give you a couple of more insights if they have something else to say which I hadn't spoken about. Okay, let's let's give it another try. The Sun card. Give me something more. Give me something more, please. It's been a struggle. You know it. Six of Cups. Being in this relationship has been a struggle. You have been surviving it. You want to get out of it. You know, in one piece at least. Victoriously, you want to, you know, walk out of it. It's almost like you're defensive. You're trying to, I want to say, conflict in such a such a way which is abusive as well again I, I showed you the five of wands i want to say the person whom you're dealing with is abusive somehow okay when you're with them it's abusive that's interesting that's not interesting that's sad that's not what else, please? No. What else, please? Show me more. Things has come to light. Yeah, think something about the other person has come to light. The moon card in reverse is coming to light and the sun again. Okay. Can you tell me more? I just want to add in something which uh, I just got. You might have found out something about a child. Okay, your person has another family. Hmm? With the, like the person was having a second family which you found out. Okay. Has a child within that. Okay. Yeah, they just swords. The womb card. Uh, 
that is not. Um, somebody might have impregnated somebody, okay? Someone, okay? Had a affair or relationship, okay? Outside uh, your foundation. Hmm? Something has come to light with regards to this uh, situation. A child is involved somehow. If the child has come into the world or not, it is a little uh, questionable with the world card in reverse. Uh, there is a involvement about a baby. However you put it, you would know. If it's your situation, you would know. Abortion or, you know, you just found out somebody is impregnated by your better half. If it is a better half, it's up to you to decide. Uh, there is a baby involvement, okay, and you're finding it out, and now you're not going to look back. Okay, initially also I saw this child involvement. Even you might have a child, okay. Now it's like you can't, you know, deal with a person who's laying around with people and uh, you know, having a couple of babies walking around, you know. What else? Uh, can I check what is this nine of pentacles about? What is this nine of pentacles? Ten of cups, four of pentacles, and knight of swords. A mother who is not happy, okay, who is waiting for some kind of, uh, you know, options out there, even if it is in the clouds, you still trying to you know trying to make it work but uh, very much helpless because you feel it is a hopeless situation like I said the person whom you're dealing with you are literally like a slave or a hostage to that person and that person is much more you know uh, wicked minded okay about keeping you under his um, what do you say under his what under him you're literally un on a leash. You can't escape that, uh, you know, from this person. And you really want to, you know, be done with this, okay? You don't want to be in this. Uh, you're holding on to so much. Um, even people wouldn't know what is going on within your relationship, okay? It's like, again, a facade in front of the other people. People, people who are who know you doesn't know what's the actual story going on behind closed doors okay you want to somehow be done with this okay whatever you have been holding on to it uh, you want to let go because you're very unhappy right now very unhappy okay you really want to let go just give me one card to uh, end this reading please you want to end whatever ten of cups you're having okay which is like four of pentacles you're holding on to it but you know you want to just Mm, you know, slice that family portrait and move on. Mm. Give me one more card. Just wrap up this reading. Four of Cups, and Seven of Wands, Two of Wands. This is how it is. The Ten, uh, the ten of Pentacles, no stability, okay? No security, nothing, okay? You don't want to uh, manifest it. You don't see a future. Okay, you don't want to move forward with this. Seven of Wands, again, you're very defensive. As I said previously as well, you're very um, guarding yourself. It's like you know, when you're getting abused, you're protecting your own body. Like I saw it earlier, so even here too, you know. Uh, so much conflict, okay. With these two cards, I see the same thing. So much conflict is going on abuse physically as well okay and you you can't take it anymore you can't take it anymore this is like um, i would say third party involvement is there okay even with the sun card uh, this person is out going outside uh, this relationship and making babies out there maybe okay at least you might have found out about about a baby and this is not what you want okay these two cards tell me the same thing ten of pentacles there is no security for uh, for you okay within this relationship 
Yes, and you're looking for options out there. Hmm? You're looking for options out there. Even if it, if it feels like you can't escape, you're still not losing faith on the situation. Okay, you are still trying. Okay, you will go to any extent to get what you want. You'll go uh, to move on from this current situation. I'll stop here. This is Marjorie, your child, Loga, and Alex week. Bye.